the depth of primary pain. I'm sure by now you've heard many wonderful experts talk about trauma as in what happened is what happened with anxiety. Yes, we can all agree on that now at this stage. But the reality is there's another step beyond that. What is it that happened with them? What is it that happens? Why does primary pain happen? How does it happen? How does it take hold in the body? Why do we rem why do we not remember it? Why do we not hold it in our memories if it's so fundamentally difficult and painful and stored in the body? And there's all sorts of, of reasons for that. But if we're if we're just trying to understand primary pain, then it is on it is important to understand what depth of primary pain is. Primary pain isn't one emotion, which the title of primary pain would tend to suggest it's one emotion. It's not, it's not one thing. It's not just the feeling of shame or just the feeling of humiliation or just the feeling of nothingness. It's not just that. That in of itself is difficult. But primary pain is what I call the totality of an experience. It's a total, there's a total experience. It's unique, fingerprint unique to you. It has a pattern within it. So it's not just a feeling, it is somatics. It's not just somatics, which is the way the body holds it. It, it can be physical. It's not just physical. It can have defense mechanisms attached to it. It's not just that. It'll have words. It'll have vocabulary. It'll have a nervous system response to it. And it'll have also what we inside that a pattern of identifications and what, what we call priming, which is, which is associations. I am worthless, therefore no one will connect. So it has this kind of this kind of pattern of emotion and meaning and attachments and associations and feelings. And all of that go to make up the totality of an experience. Now, every single one of us have this primary, have some pieces of primary pain in us. And every single one of us have that from either trauma, tall T trauma, small T trauma that we're not even aware of. And these are the patterns that exist within us. This is what happened within us. That's the detail of what happened within us. So access to those patterns, not just the top level feeling that, of humiliation, or, or, but just the detail of 